Hello, kind YouTubers. This is Mr. T. And if you don't like me, I'm going to beat you down. And then I'm going to put one of my chains on you. Because I'm going to say that. <sighs> yeah, I'm working on something, man. First of all, I hope all you guys enjoyed the, the shenanigans of April 1st. Getting food with all the troll videos and all that stuff. Never going to give it up. Never going to let you go. Something like that. Hope you guys also enjoyed it. WrestleMania! And, uh, yeah, I didn't get a chance to actually see WrestleMania. But from what I've heard, it was pretty, pretty good. Yeah, and, uh, I did get a chance to see a YouTube video of WrestleMania. And it was Sting versus Triple H. And when I say nostalgia, man, seeing the NWO and DX do their thing, it was off the chain. And, of course, that's why I got on the TikTok to show my... 24 inch pythons, brother. What are you gonna do, man? But yeah, I hope I don't get flagged for copyright. But in the background, little shop of horrors playing. Sunny Seymour! Stop saying it before you get copyright for that. Okay. So this is in the local Walmart where I live, and uh, I checked it out. And, uh, thought about for about fucking. Fuck it, like a couple of seconds. I was like, let me get that. And I was actually confused because this is my second take doing a video because I thought it was from an area in my state, but apparently I'm wrong. And uh, it's called the, it's from the Brewmaster series and it's a hop project. Hop project. That's what it's called. It's a Yazoo. It's a, the Yazoo uh, Brewing Company in Nashville, Tennessee. Nashville, Tennessee. Yazoo Hop Project L. This is a hoppy beer. Hoppy beer. So this beer's gonna hop out my hand. But um anyway, <laughs> we take pale munch, munch and caramel malts and completely overwhelm them with our unique blend of spicy, citrusy American hops. To find out more about how this beer was made, visit www.yazoobrew. Dot blogspot.com. So, yeah, it's handcrafted, by the way. So, if you want to check out more about this beer, you just go over here. Okay, uh, so let's see. Is this looks like a twist of Cowboys pop off. Okay, do your research, man. But I'm always prepared. This is pop off capsule. I got my little. Yeah. Keys, man. You gotta have one of these, man. But yeah, as always, for our trusty beer reviews, we have our trusty mug. Yeah. There's the cap, by the way. But let's get rid of the boards. Yeah, the first thing you get you is the nice little head I poured there. It's kind of translucent, gives you a little shadow on my finger. Let's go with the smell. It's very hoppy. <laughs> but let's get ready to drug some of that. can tell that it's a, got a citrus taste and um, there's a lot of stuff going on here. It's like it's crisp. It has a um, caramel. It has a... Uh, I can't look like Some sweetness. It's a little bit of that. There's a little bit in between. Yeah. I like it. It's uh, pretty, pretty good. It does have a bitterness, but it's not that bad. Not that bad, you know. Whew. It also makes you sneeze. 
Oh, it's not bad though. This is definitely a beer you have to take your time to savor. Very, 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 very good. Is it? Uh, but yeah, it's not bad. It's good. It's pretty good. But yeah, I would probably give it a thumbs up. Very, very good craft beer. It has a lot of elements that have been brought in from different other craft beers, and it, it's not bad. <clears throat> but yeah. This is Jug 82. Sonic on.